I am back with another video. This time, this video is going to be a little more in depth because I'm glad that the sun is not out because the sun be trying to peek through the trees and all of that. And it kind of messed up my video. But now, I'm going to give you guys a real good look at this car because <clears throat> when I first got it, it was a lot of sun and stuff out and I couldn't get the video and stuff like I wanted to. And the sun is down. This is the perfect spot. This is my 89 box Chevy on sixes. I can't afford nothing else, YouTube. To you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. And then hopefully I can get my, my, uh, my view hours up. I made a, uh, a thousand subs. I got 2,000 more hours to get before I get monetized and stuff. So I'm not doing it for the money, but I ain't gonna turn it down either. So if I can get some money out of the situation, I will. But here's the car, YouTube. Just want y'all to check it out. Everything is there, how I like it. Some stuff that I did was, it had a pinstripe on it already, but I ordered a thicker, a thicker pin, pinstripe I also ordered the molding let's go down the side of it let's look down the side of it the body looks pre pretty good but guess what you two look who's peeking look who's looking over here at us y'all see her y'all see her you two look at her over there Ready to get her engine taken out. We see you over there. But anyway, just wanted to let you guys check this one out. This one is real clean. Uh, cruise control work in it. Look at the inside. Now that ain't no sun out, we can look at the inside real good now. Hey, see what I'm saying? I ordered a new dash pad for it. Box Chevy Queen put me on that. Now I can get y'all can get a good look at this interior. Look at this interior. I don't know why my dome light ain't coming on. Let me check that out. That's what I'm talking about, YouTube. We get a chance to really look at it. That's a little tweeter I put back there. Y'all hop down in the comment section, man. Tell me about this interior, man. I drove five hours to get this car. I changed the bulbs in the... If y'all can look real close, I changed the bulbs in there. They blue. I think this car got 53,000 miles on it. I'm guessing. It's the console which was already in the car. I rewrapped this steering wheel. I bought this steering wheel and I bought a half wrap, but I also took the wrap off and I wrapped the steering wheel so that so these blues can uh match. Got the blue cloth on it. Blue cloth top. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Door jams and all this painted. Whoever had this car before me took care of it. And I'm going to do the same, man. Look at that, man. That's immaculate. Ain't nothing missing off the door panels. Everything that's supposed to be there is there. And that's how I'm trying to do my car. My purple. Yeah, that's me over there, y'all. We just... Uh, haven't got time to uh, mess around with it yet because of COVID. All right, let's look at the trunk. Three Q Power 15s. Nothing, uh, you know, all, it ain't nothing crazy or nothing like that. 
3400 watt boss amp a bass processor sounds pretty good to me but i ain't gonna turn no music on because I'm trying to get monetized trying to get my page monetized so i can't have any copyrighted music so i ain't gonna worry about that but hey man i'm gonna get out here i'm gonna get this footage i'm gonna start going to different car shows tennessee mississippi i even travel to alabama to get that footage i got more footage man make sure y'all like comment and subscribe i got other videos coming pretty soon look at over there look at that purple thing over there but yeah man i just wanted y'all to check this car out without the sunlight man it, it we can really see what this car is about floor mats seats in perfect condition man headline is there doors closed pretty good the cloth top is on there whoever did it I'm not sure this is a sign I got made in West Memphis Arkansas USA signs and graphics and I went and got I went and bought this eagle out of O'Reilly and put it in the middle so the eagle didn't actually come with the sign I did that myself y'all hop down in the comment section and tell me what you think about that something I created also as you can see it got that third brake light back there let's look under the hood See, I'm gonna tell you something how my cars work. Watch how that hood pop open. Ooh. <laughs> That's when you know you got an old school there. <laughs> Stock TBI 305. Jug look almost uh, new. But man, I just wanted to show you guys, man. Heat, AC work. Cruise control work. Yeah, I was surprised the cruise control work on this thing. So man, uh, I changed the light to LEDs. I got all the bumper. You know the bumper impact strip that goes all the way across? I got to have that. See, my bumper impact strip goes all the way across. Also, on that car over there, my bumper strip goes all the way across. Now, I got a few cracks. Now, my, uh, on that other car, it got a few cracks on that bumper impact strip. Them things are expensive, too, man. By the way, if you're looking to uh, put them on your car, on your box Chevy, one on the back goes all the way across i'm gonna tell you a quick story a dude uh was trying to get uh, trying to hurry up and park his car from the police and he messed around and hit he hit that piece right there man i was so mad uh but i glued it back on there as you can see i glued it on there and i got some real clear tape right there you can't see it but it's on he actually gave me a hundred dollars for knocking that piece off Cause I'm, I, I pulled it up online. I'm like, man, hey, I gotta have that piece on my car, man. I'm not riding this car without, with missing pieces. Wheel well, it's on there. Like I said though, YouTube, I just like to have my cars with everything on them. Everything on them. So, man, when I get my subscribers up, man, I get monetized, start making a little change. And I can eventually probably afford me a grill to put on this car and that car. And uh, I'll eventually um, 
Do the dash. Do the dash too. Like I say, I want to turn the music on, but um, uh, want to turn the music on, but like I say, I'm trying to get my page monetized, so I'm not gonna really uh mess with the music. Heat blowing good. Watch the air compressor kick on. That's AC. So yeah, we already got air. We got AC too, so. I don't need none of that right now. Yeah, I don't need no AC right now. But yeah, man, I couldn't wait to... I couldn't wait to get out of work so I can make this video for y'all. Like I said, it ain't about the money, man. I appreciate you guys for even subscribing to my channel, for one. So I'm not going to stop the content if I get denied or whatever the case may be. I'm going to still bring you this content. Because of the simple fact that I like old schools myself. So I pull up on somebody and say, hey, man, I got a YouTube channel, man. You think I can put your vehicle on my page? And I go from there. So make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, man. Because I'm going to be trying to travel everywhere and get footage of different cars. Mainly old schools. I'm not a big fan of Mopars and all those other cars I mean but I will get footage of them they do most of the clowning and the burning out and stuff like that I ordered a microphone for my uh, for my phone but I didn't even put it in I was so ready to make this video for you guys because this probably end up being the last video of the year because I'm not going to do too much to it right now I told y'all I can't afford it, man. Y'all help me get these subscribers. Uh oh, look at them. Now I ain't never got both of them cards. Get both of these cards together. Look at them. But anyway, keep them Arkansas plates on there. Even though I stay in Memphis, I keep the plates on there because it's so easy to go get my tags renewed and get tags in uh, Arkansas versus Memphis. Then again, I never tried to get them in Memphis. It's just so damn big of a city that I'm pretty sure the line probably be long. So I keep the Arkansas place over there. I mean, I keep the Arkansas place on it. Yeah, some little cheap sixes, man. It still, it still look presentable to me. It ain't too wild or nothing like that. You know, hey, I scored them rims for 800 bucks, man, just to get a car a little push. Then eventually, start getting myself right and. Getting, getting, getting a little exclusive on the wheels but anyway YouTube that was the exclusive I wanted to give you guys on this uh on this car it runs good the farthest place I took this car was somewhere in Missouri from Memphis to Missouri it drove good. It rolled good. I don't have nothing on the back. No air shocks. No nothing. Got a few blocks in the front because I wanted to have that squat. And uh, plus, uh, it was sitting down so low in the front. I had to do something. So, Because every time I hit a bump, it was scrubbing. But we got it right now. No big deal with it now. We got it right. But yeah, man, it's probably the last video. That's why I made it so long, man. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Like I say, I appreciate the 1,010 subscribers I have. For you know, you never know. Might be at 10,000. Just got to keep, keep pushing, man. Keep getting footage. Just like any other guy can do it, I can do it too. That's how I look at the whole situation. But I'm about to get out, get out of here. It's cold. Another thing I want to say. Make sure you guys keep God first, man. Keep God in your life, man. Keep praying. 
and just keep God first. We ain't perfect, but you better keep God first and met and ask him to guide you in the right direction you need to go with anything you're trying to do in life. So, hey, that's all I really want to say. Y'all make me get the Holy Ghost up. No, I'm just playing. And and what's crazy is I'm right in front of a church, actually. But anyway, YouTube, I will go over there and film that, but I don't feel like it. It's cold. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you think. What would you do to it? Really don't want to do much to this car. But drive it. Y'all stay safe.